Well, good evening to you and uh, welcome on this most perfect evening for a game of football. Conditions are absolutely splendid and the folk of this town have come out in their droves for this match. Why wouldn't they? It is an ideal circumstance for what could be an ideal game. Everybody has been attracted to it. It has been the talk of the town and uh, the buses have been packed. Double-decker buses lining up outside. Coaches have carried thousands of away supporters here too and uh, all of it adds up to make a terrific, a crackling atmosphere. The match, I think, will be quite a spectacle. This place simply a monument to the game. So much prestige, so much pride, so much passion whenever football is played here. Got things on the way. Raspilicueta. He's got options out wide. He's had a shot! Marvellous goal! What a start and what a contribution from the main man. I had a feeling he might do something given his reputation, but to do it like that, absolutely brilliant. I wasn't expecting that. That was easy, almost too easy. Well, he made it obvious as to where the pass should be played, Peter, and it made the finish look that bit easier. Chelsea are ahead, one goal to the good. Billing. He's and no Billing! It's in! 2 0 and in next to no time. That really was a thing of beauty, curled in effortlessly. You know, I'm not going to be hard on the goalkeeper because that moved all over the place on its journey. Things starting to look very comfortable. Well, it's been a, an absolutely fabulous spell for them and they're starting to look unstoppable. There could be more on the way. Doesn't get the pass he's looking for. Jorginho. Sayek. Lerma with a good steal, well played. And here's Aubameyang. Aubameyang. Regardless of the outcome, it is good to see someone running at the defence like that. Well, you could see he was eager to get a shot away, but there was too much flesh and bone in his path. Billing. Just to point out, Peter, that the fullbacks are quite high. And what do they try to achieve? Well, it's obviously a move to push um, the opposition wide men back and, and give them more to think about. So Solanke! Goal! And they are dragging it back! Game on again! Bournemouth produced a lovely sequence of passes there. It's a terrific brand of football to watch, and importantly, it is a strong end product.
This is threatening to become a really good game. I think they can sense a comeback here, and so can this crowd. It's all systems go now. Lerma. Lerma. So midway through the first half, and it is a tight old tie. Steered forward. Bournemouth have it back, and they can go again. Lerma. Yeah, he's pulled him up for that challenge. Yeah, that's top defending and preventing him turning, which can open up many plus. That's a hit! It's a goal! And there's the goal they've been looking for. And time and space are plenty, he was never going to miss. Well, it's pretty damning on the part of that defence, Peter, that he was allowed so much time and space. But I think you have to give credit where it's due. And it was a brilliant setup and finish. He's made it three, quite a day at the office for him. Oh, he's been unstoppable in this match. Every single time he's been in possession, he's looked a threat. Chelsea took a two-goal lead and are looking good for the win. They've seen the light and the opposition have been left in the dark. Forward it goes. Look at the defender bombing forward. And he's cut it out. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Brooks. Gets it back. Just ruffled a few feathers, but well dealt with. Solanke. And the shot! And yes, it's there! Well, you know, thinking about that, I think they've perfected that on the training ground because it took them seconds to get the ball from back to front and they really commit forward in numbers too. That was all very well drilled. We have got ourselves a game here. Listen, goals change games, and that has changed the whole complexion of this one. They have the momentum now. Lerma. Chelsea are in control here on the brink of half-time. Loses his balance and loses the ball. Tries a shot! Straight at the keeper. His reputation is better than what we've just seen. And it's Zaya. Chelsea desperately needs someone to hold up the ball here. Zaya. It's anyone's ball. Hoists it forward, and the counter is on. Thiago Silva battles to win it back, looks to clip it forward. And it's half-time here. It's kind of a hard one to call, Peter, isn't it? I mean, from what we've seen, 
so far both sides have provided ample evidence that they can add more goals and I'm sure their respective managers have reminded them that the next one will be pretty crucial so it's going to be interesting to see how the teams come out for the next period Chelsea do lead but it's quite a game half time 3-2 the action has already resumed here. Aubameyang. He's got away. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Well, the crowd clearly liked what they just saw. Some real no-nonsense defending. Cut out in the nick of time. Driving on now, what can they conjure from here? Has a hit! It's there! Oh, beautifully dispatched. There was no reaching that. Yeah, anything that finds its way into the net via the framework of the goal is most difficult for the keeper to reach. He was never going to get it. So the lead now is two. The crowd are calling for this to be put to bed. There's little sympathy about. Aubameyang is effectively being marked out of the game here. Well, it's about time, isn't it? Only after he's uh, just notched a third. Well, the defence got the better of him this time, but I'm sure he'll go again. Got a shot away! Billing, Billing plays it forward, 60 minutes played. Raspilicueta, and back to base. And it's played forward, I think that's offside, yes it is. put a stop to that and, Sterling! and they've been caught out here danger averted for now has a look and has a go gave it a go but off target Thiago Silva came up with a, a decent crack, but he knew rather quickly he'd gotten underneath it. Koulibaly. He's made sure that that won't get through. Keeper sends it forward. And they've got it back as soon as they gave it away. And it's Sterling. Sterling! Oh, what a wonderful stop! Well, as Tesco Peter, the keeper has just received an A plus grade. Tries to switch the play. Brooks has created one goal already. from immediate danger.
Aubameyang displaying his defensive capabilities there. That's no striker's tackle. Well, they say that your front lads should be that first line of, um, of stopping the opposition, and I think he's taken it to another level with his desire to get back and, and help everyone out. Just brushed off the ball there. And he's going long. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. Sterling. Oh, sweet feet. He's been bundled over, that is a foul. Well, he was the one player you had to keep away from the area. Not the best way to do it, though. He's gone for goal! It's off target and by quite a way. Done very well to intervene. Billing gets it away. Foul and a free kick in a very dangerous area. And it's hoisted clear. Solanke. Can't get the better of his opposite number. Brooks. Surely this will be the last chance. And he just whacks it away. And that's it. Chelsea have won it. As much industry as inspiration. Whatever the formula, it has worked for them. So Jim, how do you reflect on what we've seen? Yeah, we knew there was a sizable gap in the quality of both squads and, and the story was told in predictable fashion. And thanks to Jim alongside me. And as the fans make their way home, so must we. Good evening to you.